everyone. I am about to show you how I make my, <coughs> sorry, DIY peppermint the hot chocolate. Sorry, got up really early today, so I'm kind of tired. So let's get started, shall we? I take Nestle, sorry, Nestle mini marshmallow hot chocolate mix right here. Two packets and you just add or add or take away how many packets you do depending on how many people you're making it for. I'm just making it for my mom and I, so <clears throat> just doing two. Okay. okay. Okay, I'm gonna fill this up with. Oh, our slide. Idiot. An idiot. Um, okay, fill it up with one cup of water and then I'll fill up a half a cup of milk. Mixture of milk and water. One and a half cups. Oh, it helps if I turned on the eye. Sorry. Upper lip itches. That goes right in and I'll let that heat up for a couple minutes. <sighs> Meanwhile, I'll show you uh, some pretty flowers we got. Ran into a chair. Um, so yeah, I got these pretty flowers yesterday for my mom, and I don't know what they're called, um, but they're a really good deal. I'm not sure if you guys can see it. They see those little like um I want to say ripples in the water and milk mixture. I'm going to let that go for another minute until it's like not boil almost to a boil but not quite. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> then I'm gonna add one of these guys in here. Watch when I open it'll break on me. And I am correct. <laughs> Haven't even opened it yet. Apparently it doesn't want to open for me. Um... So, we're just going to go on my camera here. Um, there it goes. Um, well, there it went. Alright, so that goes in. You're like, what are you doing? This gives it the peppermint flavor, like I, like I said. 
Yes, I know that seems a little weird, but I try. I did it one, the what well, I think a couple winters ago, a couple years ago. Um, it may it may sound weird, but trust me, try it and it is really good. And I'm trying to get the last bit out, but apparently it doesn't want to cooperate today. There. Alright, now I got that in. That was not easy. It did not, the kitty cat didn't really want to come out, so to speak. Whisk. Um, I think it might, I don't know, let me, ch whoa. <laughs> That uh, adds some color to it. Hold on, I'll show you guys. Okay. As you can see here, now it turned it like a pink color. Oh, just wait until the uh, hot chocolate gets out, and then it's gonna get crazy. I just stir that in, let the peppermint flavor just, you know, see, bleh, cannot talk today, steep in, sorry, <laughs> like I said, I got up really early this morning, so I'm kind of tired, so just please bear with me, <laughs> and I'm going to add the packs of hot chocolate. Get every little last bit out I can. Now, last year I made this a lot. I made two versions. I made one without coffee for people who don't still drink coffee. That's fine. I mean, not everyone likes coffee, so. But I made one with coffee, and I, I had that a lot during the December season. Arc season. Month. Oi. Tired. <laughs> so anyways, I'm just letting this do its thing until I, s until I see the powder bits almost completely dissolve. Now granted, sometimes they don't want to and they're stubborn, so let's see what we get today, shall we? Oh, hello right here. <laughs> okay, uh... I'm going to try, oh, that's hot, as you can see, it completely just absorbed the peppermint flavor, so we don't need that anymore. Sticky. Alright, okay, letting it whisk for a little while, well, mix for a little, sorry, like I said, just be patient. <laughs> This yummy Hershey's chocolate syrup. <clears throat> Alright, so not a lot, but so now I mix that in too to really drive home the chocolate flavor. Because this peppermint is kind of strong, so it just helps balance out the flavors. Okay, now. I'm gonna go fancy for you guys today. Uh, all right, I will be right back and I'll show you the finished product. I'm just gonna pause you guys. See you in a sec. All right, so we're gonna serve up the, the, uh, I can't talk today. Uh, Peppermint hot cocoa. I'm sorry I cannot talk today. Alright. 
so I'm going to go do this over the sink. I'm going to put a little bit of this on it, ready whip. Okay, you can see here it's steaming. Okay. I'm going to do the same thing to this one. Put the cream on top. And uh, give me a second because <laughs> I don't. Oh. <laughs> then I put on. Just ignore that, please. Some crushed. Peppermint. Okay, so I'll put the crushed peppermint with the other crush, with the other peppermint. If it'll evaporate. Alright, I'll show you guys the finished product. So this is a finished product. Again, I just took two packs of these. I added a cup of hot water and a half a cup of milk. Stirred it and I added a candy cane in there to give it the, oops, the flavor of peppermint. And then I added some Hershey's chocolate syrup and just top, top, or topped it with some crushed candy cane. So thank you for watching. Bye.